automatic subtitle generator, like the free one, the best one. So far, I've, I've tried a few, and this one's the best one so far. So let's, let's dive into this. Jianyin. So go to, uh, go to this website. I'm going to put the link below. Jianyin. It's probably in Chinese. Oh, unfortunately, it's in Chinese. So uh, that's, that's, <laughs> but like this, it's really good. And like it detects like, in, in, oh, I think English and Chinese very well. So um, download this. Use uh, you can use this uh, Google Translate if you don't if you can't read it. But this is probably the blue button in the middle of the website. Download it and then um, install it, and then open the app. Okay, and it's gonna look like this. There's a button up here, this plus button. Click that. And if you're familiar with Final Cut, they, there's a lot of shortcuts that are really similar. Um, but here, here's where you put your um, your your footage. Um, let me let me find something here. Okay. Uh, okay, I'm gonna drag this in there. So drag your footage in there. Boom. Okay, and then just drag it into your timeline. Okay, and then go to this T button, which is text. You see that? Okay. Go to that and then um, go to this button here. This this button right here, look at that. And then click that and then click this first blue bluish green button right here. And then and it's gonna start generating your um, subtitles really quickly. Okay, it's done. It's done. So um look. You can um, you can hit Control and push the plus sign, or you could hold Control and scroll to make it bigger or wider. I mean, to make it wider, and then uh, get a good camera nowadays because every camera is just pretty good, even like the iPhone. So um, I think you, there's so much. Okay, so let's say you have this. Okay, you could click and you click onto one of the texts. And then you can adjust it. So scroll down on the side here, over here. Scroll down. You can adjust the text. Ah, this thing's scrolling really fast. You adjust the text size. Okay. You can even add a stroke around it. Okay. You can also choose a font here. Uh, it's all in Chinese, so kind of pick the font you like. And like when you adjust the, the the position of this one, the risk it changes with it. See, look, so it all changes according to that first one. So anyway, I hope that helps, and I hope uh, that saves you a lot of time. It sure really helps me. Unfortunately, it is in Chinese, simplified Chinese. So if you could read a little bit of Chinese like me, that that helps a lot. I my Chinese not that great either, but um. Uh, it's free, so go in the link below. And uh, if you, uh, I usually don't edit my my film in Jianying. I usually do it in Final Cut and then export it into Jianying and then add this. Just use it for just caption. Anyway, um, I hope that helps, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.